Hey guys, this is Rosita, your go-to vocal and language coach here on TakeLessons.com. So welcome to beginning Japanese and sent beginning Japanese sentence structures. In this lesson, we're going to learn how to use a sentence pattern for expressing your ability to do something. AKA, we're going to use we're going to learn how to use the auxiliary verb can. Now, the sentence structure that we're going to use today will be person in the topic marker wa plus something plus the direct object marker ga dekimasu. For an example, watashi wa nihongo ga dekimasu. I can speak Japanese. Please repeat after me. Watashi wa Nihongo ga dekimasu. To say the person can do something in Japanese, the topic in this case, watashi wa, is going to come first. Then the something, which will be nihongo, with a subject marking particle ga, and then we're going to end with the verb dekimasu. Watashi wa nihongo ga dekimasu. Now the verb dekimas means can or be able to, expressing that someone is able to do something or sometimes someone is able to do something well. With this verb dekimas, ga is usually going to be the direct object marker we're going to use rather than the direct object marker o. So let's do some practice. Here are some vocabulary that we're going to use for the practice segment of this video. First, we have yori. Please repeat after me. Ri, o, ri. Yori. Good, which means to cook. Benkyo. To study, please repeat after me. Ben, ki, yo, benkyo. Next. We will have piano. Please repeat after me. P A No. Uta. U Ta U. To sing. Please repeat after me. U Ta U. Uta. Guitar. Guitar. Please repeat after me. Guitar. Nihongo, which means Japanese. Please repeat after me. Nihongo. Nihongo. Eigo, which means English. Please repeat after me. E I Go. Eigo. Good. All right. So let's get started. How would we say, I can play the piano? Alright, let's try the guitar. Ne? How would we say I can play the guitar? Mm. Hi, Salarashi. Watashi wa guitar ga dekimasu. Alright, so let's review. To make the pattern for expressing your capability or your ability to do something, we're going to use the sentence structure person, the topic marker wa, the something that you're able to do, the subject marking particle ga, and we're going to end with the verb dekimasu. Alright guys, this will conclude today's video. Hopefully this has been helpful. If you guys have any questions whatsoever, please do not hesitate to ask. If you guys are watching this on YouTube, go ahead and write your questions in the comment section below. Or if you're watching this on Take Lessons, go ahead and click that button that says ask a question. All questions do go directly to me. Tis the season, guys. I am now actually accepting new students. So if you guys are interested, 
please go ahead and check out my profile at takelessons.com. The link is in the description window below. Go ahead, click on it or copy and paste it. We actually have awesome specials going on right now. All right. Well, hopefully I'll get a chance to talk or even see you soon. Bye. Janet.